Lads, what you're soon gonna realize is that everybody who's not entirely with you is against you. And even in Latin, the word enemy means antagonist, not your friend. So I want you to just think deeply about, are your so-called friends, are they actually your friends? Because a real friend is someone who supports you, someone who's got your back all the way until your goals. And, there, and, and guys, I know this for a fact, most of you guys won't even dare tell your friends what your goals are. You won't tell them where you want to take your physique. You won't tell them what you want to accomplish in your career. You won't tell them how much money you want to earn because they're going to laugh at you and they don't even have the belief that it's possible because they're going to be small-minded little bitches for the rest of their life, right? Just because they go out to the pub and they throw a pint around with you and they go, hey, let's get pissed together. That does not make them a friend. That actually makes them, in, in the dictionary, an enemy. They are going against your goals. They are an antagonist. So everyone thinks they've got loads of friends. Right now you've got loads of fucking enemies that you need to get rid of. And you need to start building up real friends, people who help you to your goals. You need to get surrounded by guys who are on the same mission and just, just literally know whatever you say you're gonna accomplish. They know you're gonna do it. And, and also people that will call you up. People think I call people out. I don't call people out. I call them the fuck up. Anybody in any of our programs, if they start operating from a level where they start lacking in action because of emotion, they get called the fuck up. No emotion, no feeling can ever get in the way of action. And real guys, real men will call you up on that. And they will, they will be like, no, man the fuck up. You've got duty. You've got goals to achieve. I don't care if you feel a little bit sad or tired today. You've got work to do, you've got weights to lift, and you've got money to go and fucking earn. End of, right? So start thinking about, are you actually surrounded by guys that are aligned with you and are taking you to this goal? Are they actually a complete enemy, an antagonist to where you wanna go? Because if they are, successive subtraction guys, you've gotta remove them. You've gotta get rid of the breaks and then start working on getting into new circles. You've got the internet, guys. You can get in the rooms. I don't know, I mean, I've probably met 15, 20 of my clients in the last few months, but we got hundreds of clients online that I don't actually spend time with in person, but yet we still call them up. We still support them all the way to their goals and we still give them a completely different life. Right? You don't need to just be in proximity to these people because I know some of the lads watching will be like, oh, but Tom, but Tom, I, like, I don't live near any of these people. You won't. The reality is you won't because they're going to be living in fucking Dubai. They're going to be living in Miami. They're going to be living in the, the best places because they're already killing it. But they still want it for you and they will call you the fuck up if you get in proximity to them online. Then you'll be chilling with them in person because you'll be living the same lifestyle as them when you've actually just adopted the blueprint they've given you. And a lot of people struggle with how to figure out where they want to go with it all and, and and before we even get into that guys just start thinking about what you don't want I think once people realize what they don't want as a friend what they don't want as a body what they don't want as a career what they don't want as a lifestyle what they don't want from women it helps you identify what you want and I think most of you just haven't done that work yet you haven't asked yourself the questions what don't you want from friends and you don't want people that tell you you can't do stuff but you can't even tell your mates what you want to do because they tell you you can't do that that's not possible anything is fucking possible when you're around the right guys it's all about getting your belief systems in the right place so you got to fuck these people off and you got to go work all on you and stop optimizing to be liked stop saying yes to people stop going to the football with them stop fucking going drinking pints with them. Stop people pleasing them. Stop going for a Mackey's drive through with them because they've asked you to, to keep them happy. Optimize for being respected by you just being the guy that they would trust to take you through fucking battle rather than just someone who's liked. Being liked gets you nowhere with guys other than staying at the bottom of the pack and being liked by women gets you fucking nowhere. It gets you cheated on. You need to optimize to be respected right? It does not matter. If you are respected, if people can look at you and go, he makes good decisions. He looks fucking sick. He clearly makes good decisions because he's got fucking bank account. He clearly makes good decisions because he's got the fittest fucking chick. He clearly makes good decisions because he lives a sick lifestyle. 
people will respect you. Lads will, women will, whatever their first impressions are of you. They know you make good decisions. They know they respect you. Even if you've said something, they might not quite agree. They might not like you. They will, they will come in proximity to you because respect gets you everywhere in life. You ain't getting to the top unless you become someone that's respected. So stop people pleasing. Stop trying to be liked. Get these fucking retards out of your fucking life. Success is subtraction. Remove them and get around the guys that are gonna help you to the top. Right now, your friends aren't friends. They are enemies. They are fucking enemies. Anybody that is not all in with you to the very top, doesn't align with you to the very top, is an enemy. You've gotta realize this, guys. When you, when you grow up and you, not grow up in terms of age, but grow up mentally, maturity and wisdom wise, you really realize that most people are just in it for themselves. They're not in it for you. You need people that just, their purpose is just to become their best self and pull you up fucking with them. They're real friends. The world is lacking that. That's obviously why I've got EO1, my business, full of guys, full of fucking savages on one mission because it's hard to find these days. Go make it happen. Figure out what you don't want and optimize for respect. Stop trying to be liked. Get respect first, then be liked, fine. But respect is gonna get you places. People pleasing, being a little bitch around little bitch boys is getting you nowhere. It's keeping you at the fucking bottom. Change it.